So a buddy of mine just called and one guy just came by and said, you made a video of my 409? I said, I did, but no sound. I'm so pissed off. Cross Ram, Buick Stage 1, convertible, Thunderbird 57. Wow, one of none, Grand Sport X, GSX. I walked around here for 38 minutes making a video. God, this annoys me to no end. I had my headset on right over here. I tested it, it was working. And 38 minutes of walking and talking and I got nothing out of it. The battery's gonna go dead now. We got Corvettes, we got Fox Body Mustangs, we got GT Cobras, Cadillac V8s, 68 442 convertible and luscious resale red. Everything is so nice and so funky. And this looks like the water out of Flint, Michigan. Just like I had said in my video I made a few minutes ago, but it didn't record the sound. How annoying is that? 64 Biscayne, done up so nice and so sweet. What a beauty. Everything is so sanitary and clean and tucked up and looking just right. Wow, what a beautiful car. Got some regular iron in here. We got a Maverick. Not much else down here. I'm going to take a shortcut. I just really annoyed now. The sun's going down. The cars are starting to leave. People have been here for two, three hours. I got here at 4.30, which was actually 5.30, but it was 4.30 because you lose an hour or you gain an hour, depending which way you're going. 71 El Camino SS. Barracudas and Plymouths and Novas and pickup trucks with cast iron headers and big turbochargers and patina. Done long time ago, I think. Looks real authentic. Buick Electra 225. What a party barge. 1969, maybe? What a beauty. Into the sunset on Route 66. This one looks so good. It's got ramjet fuel injection. It's got a record player under the dash. Yep, RCA Victor. Ramjet fuel injection. We can't show you the stuff that we showed you a little while ago because we're out of time now. It's getting dark, cars are leaving. We got a whole parking lot full of cars and we're just beginning. And I am so annoyed and I hope nobody else calls me because when they call, the phone turns off the recording and goes into phone call mode. I told my buddy, do not call back, don't answer me, nothing. 346 pack, just like Nick's Garage. You wanna watch Mopar, you watch Uncle Tony's or you watch Nick's Garage. Thunderbirds and Challengers. This one's been in the family for going on 50 years. Yeah, there they were. A young, lovely couple. Lucky to have their health and enjoy it and enjoy the car and a Thunderbird with a 429 Thunderjet. Back then it was all about naming the car and naming this. And 62 Grand Prix and an 84 98 chocolate brown two door Regency. Rome Cadillac 1971 no V Fleetwood Brome with a divider Cadillac 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 it's Cadillac style air conditioned Cadillac beater Cadillac convertible Cadillac DeVille so this is where we're gonna start over our video. Too bad I couldn't dub on the sound, but I'm not that fancy. 327 Impala SS 68, big block Chevelle SS 396, Nova 67 442. I think this is what I ended my video at right here at this 442. The video ran out, memory was full, and I played it back to see where it ended, and no sound. Why? We'll never know. Four-speed, 442, 400 four-speed dual exhaust, or four-barrel four-speed dual exhaust, depending what year it was. 69 Chevelle, clean and shaved and all shiny. Olds 442, 1969, Ramrod 400, forced air induction. Right there, where the air was cold, and the bugs, and the road dirt. <laughs> and they went to that expensive outside air induction W20, W25 hood. W30, yeah, yep. or W31, or right. Rally. Right. Cool car. Thanks. No vinyl top. Jim didn't make their profit on this one. Four speed, yeah. Survivor Cutlass. 
white with a red interior and no vinyl top. How annoying. I am so PO'd. I checked my sound and it's not working. DeLorean back to the future. Corvette, Corvette. Cool 30. Oh, Pontiac. Flathead 8. Nope, I don't think so. Small block with three twos. Chevy never offered three carburetors on their small block. But Edelbrock and Offenhauser did, and this has got what looks like Corvette Hollies. Vacuum operated front and back carbs. Got a lot of Corvettes here. We're going to have to make our way real quick. Had a, such a nice video, I think it was, anyways. 38 minutes of walking and no talking. Everybody was quiet. How annoying. Why do things malfunction? Honda. Six cylinder flathead. Super Hurricane Willys. And we've got a Packard. Late 40s, I'm guessing. Cadillac. Ooh. Thunderbird. What's going on? 64 Chevelle. 68 Camaro. Convertible. 61 Impala SS. Black with blue interior and accents. Yep. Later in the year, they offered the SS on the Impala. Got the dog leg shifter, little consulate. Ala SS, correctly done. W motor. Wonder who else has a few of these. Fully restored. Oh boy, big project, but you got it done. Feels good, looks better, and goes great. She's real fine. The Beach Boys made it famous, racing a 348 that they called a 409. I've sung that song many times. 348 high performance. W motor Chevrolet truck engine turned high performance car engine. And they do go. You'd never know it by those spinner hubcaps. This is a hot rod and Pala SS. Beautiful. Mustang, everything's here with a Cobra motor, 64, 5, 6, 289, maybe a 271 horsepower K with solid lifters. This is what killed the Corvair. Lee Iacocca's better idea take a Falcon, turn it into a hot rod. Mason Jar of Death. 396 Nova, 69, 350 horse, and a little Nova. What a beautiful car. Chrome accents, it's a real super sport. Nash Metropolitan, just like my buddy just saw in Alaska. He was in Alaska. 77 Trans Am, TA 6.6 .6 with T-tops, and Goodyear Wingfoots. When's the last time? Saw a pair of wingfoots. Monte Carlo driver quality Chrysler New Yorker. Big block 67. Ford 51. Cool Ford. Thunderbird. Look at that beak. Landau roof, personal luxury. Look how beautiful this interior was. Look how nice that interior was. What a beautiful car. Rim blow steering wheel, yeah, you beeped it right over here. Cruise control was over here. Or no, it was over there. Hmm, I don't know. Got a lot of options here. Got a bunch of Corvettes, various later model years, 80s, 90s. Brand new Camaro, or almost brand new Camaro. This is a Corvette, CR1, Mustang, Corvette, Z28, Mercury Marauder, gorgeous, turquoise color, wow, this is so nice, air conditioned, beautiful, 62, gorgeous, FE Block 390, T-Bucket, or a 32, something. Can't tell you the year. The sun's going down. We better hurry up. So, three more rows. A spotted dog is here. 
We've got a DJ here. We're at Cozy Corner. Just about 45 minutes west of Chicago. The great city of Chicago. Got some good bling on this Chevy Cheyenne. Short bed. Nice deluxe model. Look how nice this Chevy is. Big bopper DJ service. Well, look how cute that face is. What a baby. Hi, baby. Well, we got some barking to do. Mass <laughs> Metropolitan. Suzuki two stroke. GT Shelby. Four barrel with vacuum secondaries. Dual feed vacuum secondary. Goodyear F. E7015s, Carol Shellboy alloy wheels, signed by the man, the great man, who turned a lowly Mustang into a hot rod. Four speed Hurst shifter, Fox body Mustang, five liter HO, 392 Hemi with a shaker, Cadillac low to the ground. Wait a minute. What do we got here? We got some valve covers over the top of something. Yep. Modern muscle made to look old. All right, ladies and gentlemen, about that time of the night, I'm going to do the awards for the evening. Supercharged. Uh, the the uh, trophy awards that we have. And then uh, anybody that still has the tickets outstanding, I've got three tickets, or two, I'm sorry. 596, 69, and Palace, If anybody has Mall those tickets, convertible. we'll let another five minutes go past. Corvair, 63. Pick it up and give you an award, thanks. Automatic power glide, we'll be seeing those very shortly. We're zipping through here because we missed our opportunity. My phone didn't record the sound. You heard that enough. I'm annoyed. Just make you want to take your phone and run it over with your 409 or your Tornado or your Corvair or anything. Big block. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to do the awards here tonight. 66 Impala Super Sport. Uh, 65. 66. And I think the man that I'm going to big refer block. to here. 427, 425 with air conditioning so. and the big His name is Mike. pulley. Woodridge. Aluminum intake dual Chevy feed holly with a four speed. Wow. Tack and gauges and clock on the dash and wood wheel. What a beautiful Impala Super Sport. Uh, and the young lady talked to you about the Fast back, so, uh, two-door hardtop, Oldsmobile. Thank you. J2 Rocket. And the second winner tonight. Three two barrels and an Oldsmobile 56-ish. With a 1969 Chevy Camaro. Viper GT, I don't fit in these. Relatively modern muscle. 71 Pontiac Le Mans with a real rumbly built big tube headers. This thing came in here rumbling. Street sleeper. White with a white vinyl top. 71 Chevelle big block 454. 64 Impala. 70 Chevelle big block. The end of the year for the Monte Carlo. Was this 87 maybe? Yep, they made the Grand National, they made the Monte Carlo. Equalizer and FM cassette loaded with options. Survivor. It's 32 years old if it's an 87 like I think it is. Monte Carlo. Staple shifter. Whoa, drag race hardcore racing party. This thing hit the drag strip. Big block 454, 71. One of 1919 bought in 78 for $2,300. Antique green, painted 1979, 454. This would have been what? 325 horse, 365 horse? Yeah, yeah, SS 454, Monte Carlo. Understated. Got the eight tracks at the ready. 71, 72, Buick. Away they go. Wow. 
This guy loved to race. Monte Carlo SS 454. Oh, that's Last SS, that's, that's, that's for sure. Then they had the S3 Laguna in 73. SSS. S3 Laguna. Wow, oh, sliding sunroof, small block, baby moons. Now these cars have a story. I might have to interview these gentlemen. They just bought this car and had it delivered. Oh, was it that one? Now I forget the story. Just had it delivered from California yesterday. Original, family owned, and what a story this one has. Just delivered. One owner from California. Need some light restoration. how I got my car, literally. California so car. That's why Bought by a youngster who's gonna turn this into his daily driver, high school and college. I'd make more of a video, but I made the first 38 minutes with no sound. I'm PO'd. <laughs> <laughs> now I got 15% battery. Things are going downhill. Yeah. You rely on these things, and I, get a portable charger, one of I got one in my pocket. I should go back and get it. Then I got to end the video. A two Buick family, four portholes and three. This one just had the engine gone through. Got a good used motor from French Lake Auto in Minnesota. Put in all the good parts. And she's a runner. Back on the road, Patina Survivors. Lovely old Buick. We're gonna come back with my charging battery pack. I should have brought it earlier, but I'm annoyed. Oh boy. You make these great videos or you try your best and the electronics don't cooperate. 65 Bel Air, big block. Hurst Old, 69. Linda Vaughn made him famous. Riding on the trunk. 455 H O. Rich man's hot rod. Yep, there's the motor trend from back in the day, June 1969. Cranberry Red, Patrick Glenn Nichols. He'll decode your Chevelle. Cranberry Red, he'll tell you about the stripes and the edges. Trans Am pace car. It's got a Pontiac 301. Turbocharged. Then they had the 3.8 and the later ones. They were playing around a lot of things, trying to make the cars go faster. Staff employee, garage area, wow. All kinds of documentation. Turbo Trans Am. Try and make them go faster. They were slugs back in the day, but Pontiac was trying. They really gave it all they had. Official pace car 72 Cutlass. Outside air induction, W30, aluminum intake manifold. Cool. GT500, with the monster Cobra Jet valve covers and air cleaner on the single four barrel with vacuum secondaries. 67, 390, GT, four barrel, 390. Chevelle SS. And Patrick Glenn Nichols will tell you if the stripe is square or rounded. On the edge. I'll see you, uh, 68 Camaro. Yeah, probably 67 stop. Chevelle, big block. Last of the chrome bumper Corvettes. 72. Yeah, the last of the chrome bumpers. They had a chrome bumper in the back. The sun's going down. Four forty Super Commando. Plymouth Road Runner, no, a GTX with a 440 Super Commando. Well, we're making up for lost time. It's the last row of cars. The battery's going to go dead any minute. And we almost got them all. 32 Ford sitting down on top of the frame. No fenders, small block Chevy with a tunnel ram. Nice Corvette. Lime green. Dodge Viper 2010, made in Michigan, right next door. Citroën, too slow for you. The disposable French car. GMC pickup 49, running a Stove Bolt 6. Chevy had the overhead valve in 1929. Let's see if we can get this battery to last the last couple minutes. Ford, look how beautiful this is. Super Deluxe V8. Yeah, the flathead. 
the beginning of the hot rod era. Ford and Buick had the hot rod nail head, and Chevy had the small block, and the races were on. They went to 12 volts. Why block Ford? A better idea than that flathead. Angel baby. Oldsmobile with three twos. Two door sedan. J2 power. Another Buick nail head. Station wagon. Wow, with four portholes. Take your family for a weekend to the beach in your four-door Buick, 1955. Fairlane 500 Ford, sport coupe with lots of trim and a four-speed, buckets and a four-speed. 73 Buick, small block, 354 barrel. Top-down fun, wow, this car is so nice. Stage one Skylark, maybe a 1970, ooh, it's a survivor. Yikes. Oh boy. Yeah, full restoration. Well, I don't know. It's a rare car, but stage one, 455. I think the rust is stage two, maybe even stage three. Oh boy. 66 Grand Prix. It's getting fixed up little by little. Buckets, console, and a three speed. Very nice Grand Prix Survivor. Should it be restored or just dolled up a little here and there, put a little bit of lipstick on it? And don't steal that dipstick. That's a rare dipstick. Air conditioned Pontiac Grand Prix. Corvette 427. This would be a 69. Nope, 68 because it has the push button in the door. First year for this Stingray body and they had cooling problems. Probably just have to cut a hole in the fiberglass, get a bit more air to the radiator. And that's it, we got one last Survivor Corvette 427 Stingray 69, but it should be a 427. Barn found Survivor. The 454 didn't come out till 1970, something tells me this was a drag racing car. I just leave it the way it is. Looks like Steel City's Gray. 69 would have been a 427, but probably blew it up a long time ago. Ghost Flames, and here's our 409 that came in so long ago when we made the no sound video. How annoying is that? She's real fine. My Chevy dog leg shifter, Bel Air 409. Bubble top. Maybe one day we'll get one of those.